It was a cold day when we found ourselves in Grand Coteau. And really, just looking for somewhere warm to go, we immediately found ourselves with a new story. So where are you from originally? Karen Crow. Okay. Not far. Before even the camera could make it in, we were already sitting down with Don Mouton. How long have you been working with flowers for? I'm um, going on 12 years. How'd you get started with that? Win Dixie. Yeah? Win Dixie on Mall Street. Win Dixie may not seem like the likely place for an origin story, but for Dawn, it would be the springboard for her career. I was in high school and needed a job, and basically they said, we don't have anything but in the floral department. And that's all it took. She started putting together scripted bouquets. We just had like a formula to follow. You know, so anybody could do it, but it was just a formula. But it was at a mom and pop place in Alabama where she was given a chance to grow. That's when I was able to really be creative and put, you know, my personal touch on things. And from there, I was like, oh, I love this. Now, back in Louisiana, she's still assembling from her little store in Grand Coteau. I've never even heard of this town. Like, I've never even been here before. Right. And a friend um, just kind of drove by and was like, hey, there's this great spot for rent. They just came up. You should check it out. That spot, now the flower barn. We love it here. It's beyond anything we ever expected it to be. Along with the traditional flower giving holidays, Dawn and her team often have a prominent role in people's biggest celebration. A lot of weddings. Weddings are kind of our specialty. Um, we do anywhere from two to four weddings a weekend. Practicing first on herself. Did you do the flowers for your own wedding? Did you I did. <laughs> I did. No, I did my own. And how was that harder than doing it for other people? It was because I make people, um, like I have to know what people want months in advance. But for my own wedding, it was basically like the week of my wedding. I'm like, okay, I have no idea what I want because I like so much. And going on to perfect the art by doing weddings for all kinds. And it was just tropical and ornate and... It was just great. Even some that are a little less traditional. We've done like a um, Star Wars themed wedding. I've never even seen Star Wars, okay? So with leaves to shine, faces to fill, and arrangements to complete, we left on, but not before. She sent us off to Iberia Parish. In Grand Coteau, I'm Daniel Phillips, KTC TV3.